perfect. Corey Hunt, everybody. He's gonna do some. He's gonna do a little comedy sketch for us, dude. I don't know if I have a sketch, um, but I used to uh, do hippie checkpoints at festivals and ask people for their best jokes, and I got some really good ones. I want to share with you. Um, so, so a stoner found the magic lamp with the genie, right? And he rubs it, and the genie comes out, and he says. Well, congratulations, you have three wishes. So his turner thinks for a second, he goes, all right, I want the best pot in the world. And no matter how many times I hit it, the joint never gets shorter. The genie's like, that's a badass wish. Fuck yeah, dude. Poof, here you go. Gets his joint, and he looks at it, he smells it, he lights it, he hits it. He's like, oh my God, this is amazing. And he hits it again. Same thing. And he's doing this for a while, watching it. It's not getting any shorter. It's been like 45 minutes. And the genie goes, hey, man, you know you still have two wishes, right? He goes, oh, yeah. I want two more of these. <laughs> so an alien and his son, uh, he did some research watching, uh, you know, things that came out on the satellite about humans. So for his son's birthday, he wanted to bring him to Earth and, and meet humans. So they land in this field and they start walking. And they walk up towards this gas station. It's got those old, you know, with a circle on top. And the dad's like, that's got to be a human. I've, I've seen things about humans. Let's go say hi to him. And his son's like, Dad, I don't know if we should talk to that human. He's like, no, it's okay. We came all the way here. Let's go say hi. And he goes, hello there. Of course, the gas station didn't say anything back and the pump. And he said, uh, well, that's kind of rude. We came all the way down here to meet humans. He won't even say hi back. Well, maybe he couldn't hear me. Let's get a little bit closer. I'll say it again. And his son's like, Dad, I don't think we should mess with that human. He's like, no, it's okay, son. Come on. He gets a little bit closer. He goes, hey there. Doesn't say anything again. He goes, well, that's... I, now he's got to be being rude. And so I'm going to walk right up to him. And I'm going to say, hello there. If he doesn't say something back, I'm going to shoot him with my laser gun. And his son's like, Dad, I think that's a bad idea. He's like, no, it's okay, son. Come with me. So they go down there, and he says, hey there. And, of course, he doesn't say anything. Blasts it with his laser gun. Gas station blows up. Him and his son fly back off into the field. They're laying next to each other, smoke rolling off of them. Dad looks at his son and goes, son, how did you know not to mess with that human? And his son goes, Dad... Anybody that gets that can wrap its dick around itself and stick it in its ear has to be a badass. <laughs> so I don't know if you know this about me, but I, I love cannabis. And, uh, you know, it, it gets bad stigma sometimes. Like, you know, people put all these out, these, these alleged side effects out there, you know, key word there, side effects. Um, but they're all bullshit, you know, like short-term memory loss, low sperm count, some third thingy. Look, what's so important about short-term memory anyways? I can't think of a thing. Besides, besides, if it was worth remembering, wouldn't it be a long-termer? Like that time I had sex, boom, keeper. And a while there, I, ha I had to cut back on, on smoking pot, so I, I had to only smoke pot every other day. And I got to tell you, those days where I wasn't smoking pot were kind of tough. I had to find constructive things to do to keep myself, you know, occupied and not thinking about it. And so one day I was like, all right, so I, I, I got a bucket of butter and some pot, and I made fucking marijuana lace butter. And I was like, nice. And I was like, oh. Dude, I should make a cake. And then I looked around. I'm like, dude, you don't have any chocolate or sugar or fudge. Dude, you don't even have a fucking oven. But I got a bucket of marijuana lace butter sitting right in front of me. So finally I said, fuck it. I'll make toast. You don't even know, dude. I ate toast and corn on the cob all fucking day. It was one of the best days I'll never remember. You didn't even know. 
I got to think of more jokes. I thought I had five minutes. I feel like it's been five minutes, but I could be wrong. This is my first time ever doing stand-up comedy. I hope you guys are having a good time. Um, okay, so this is a true story. Um, me and some friends of mine were doing, doing some gas one night. And uh, I sat there and thought about it for a while. And I'm like, man, I haven't wanted a cigarette since we started doing this. I looked at my buddy and I was like, man, I, I should just like wear a fucking backpack with a couple tanks and just a little thing here and a little button. And every once in a while, I just get a little gas and I don't need a cigarette. And he goes, that could be cool. I said, yeah, but then <laughs> people are going to look at me like, dude, why is he always fucked up? And without skipping a beat, my buddy goes, he don't smoke. <laughs> And that was great. <laughs> I got one more if I can remember how it goes exactly. <laughs> After a long day of doing nothing, I love to get go home and curl up with a good book and roll a joint on it. And smoke the joint, and throw the book in the fire and play some video games. Is that my time? I can maybe do one more. Okay. I have one in my mind and it went away. Oh, you, you shine the light at me and I'm like, oh, there was a joke there. Um... Hmm. I can't. I can't think of it now, and that's gonna drive me nuts. I love you guys. Are you guys having a great Willie Town or what? I fucking love Glow Stick Willie. We love you, Corey. I've known these guys since they were in high school and tried stealing my bike. <laughs> Not a true story. <laughs> I'd never steal a bike. You don't get in between a man and his bike. That's all I'm saying. Thank you, Corey. Everybody give it up for him. Corey!